The Atari 7800 was released in 1986. The 7800 was fully backwards compatible with 2600 games and launched at a reasonable price of only $140 US. The 1986 release was considered a relaunch since the 7800 was due to come out in 1984, but with the sale of Atari Incorporated, it was shelved until a later date. Unfortunately for Atari, they waited too late, as the Nintendo Entertainment System and Sega Genesis were dominating the gaming scene and the 7800 was not able to meet sales expectations. Another problem was the games. By this point, gamers were used to high-quality games from Nintendo and Sega, and not many gamers were very interested in 2600 games. And the 7800 library was much smaller, and most games were subpar when compared to Nintendo. Despite the setbacks and sluggish sales, however, it did last for six years, being discontinued in 1992. The 7800 may have been a great console if it had have released in 1984, but sadly, Atari's financial issues made it lose out before it even had a chance. Enjoyed that video? Well, check out the last one I did on the Atari 5200. If you really enjoyed, leave a like and maybe subscribe. Thanks for watching.